Well, it's been a long day as residents of the 30 local government areas of Ocean State trooped out in large numbers to elect the next governor of the state. Accreditation and voting began at about 8.30 a.m. in most of the polling units we monitored. Sorting and counting of votes have commenced in Olorunda local government area, Unit 004, Moore Ward, Ife East local government uh, area, and some other local government areas. After this process, the results will be sent for collation before the final result is announced. And despite the rain, voters queued at polling unit 003, also in Ileife, with the heavy downpour, INEC officials sought ballots. And out of 1.9 million names on voter register, 1.4 million persons collected their permanent voter cards. And at the end of the exercise, a winner will emerge from the 15 candidates contesting the election. So we have details of the exercise so far as captured in this report. <laughs> The leadership race is continuing in Ocean State. In no distant time, the new governor of the state will be known. So far, large turnout of voters have been recorded in most parts of the state, with many elderly persons seen in various polling units. The process is not without glitches, as was experienced with the use of the bimodal voter accreditation system, notably in Eden local government and some parts of Oshobo, the state capital. Governor of Ocean State, Buiga Uyitola and his wife cast their ballot at LA School, Ward 1, in Iragbiji, Burikwe local government area. At the governor's polling unit, large turnout was recorded, but there are complaints of insufficient beavers' devices to aid swift exercise. Um, yes, the process was very smooth, but I realized that because of the massive turnout of voters, mm. No, polling, 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 particularly, the number of machines may not be sufficient. So I want to appeal to INEC to increase the beavers because there's a time frame within which they have to vote. So people are becoming impatient because they want to count their votes. Governorship candidate Ademola Adeleke also cast his ballot at Ward 2, Unit 9 in Ede local government area. The beavers device failed to recognize his fingerprint until the facial recognition method was used. The electoral officers and other INEC ad hoc staff arrived quite early in the area. Registered voters also arrived early to check their names. This polling unit has a total of 732 registered voters. I think INEC has performed very well because when they were trying to use my uh, fingerprint, it didn't work. And they use my face, bam, and it worked. So that means that they have really improved. Well, the feelings are getting that every, everywhere is calm. Another governorship candidate, Aki Ogumbi, cast his vote at the Methodist Primary School, Ileobo, in Ayedire local government area, where he commended the large turnout of voters and the split running of the electoral process. At least uh, in these two uh, polling units, uh, the AUD and the Methodist uh, is quite peaceful, uh, very orderly. INEC uh, uh, officials are conducting it, and uh, the process is very peaceful, and they, were making, they are making progress. Governorship candidate Lassen Yusuf also exercises franchise at Waru Compound in the record and local government area. So far, the exercise has been smooth in Ocean State, with security agents visibly manning various polling units. As early as 17.